powerful and blessed prayers to uproot every evil attack. Father Lord, I come against every evil attack of the enemy over my life. I destroy such attacks by the fire of the Holy Spirit. Father, I decree by the authority of heaven that the fire of the Holy Ghost destroy every attack of the enemy over my life threatening well-being. Amen. Hello brethren in the Lord. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Prayer Altars. As usual, we have five prayer points for you to pray today. You are expected to pray each prayer point repeatedly for at least two minutes. And I see God answer you speedily in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. To continue, kindly pray all the prayer points in this video, then like and subscribe if you have not done so. Please also, make comments and share this video link with your loved ones and provide feedback to us in the comment section. You shall enjoy life to its fullness in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So let's go into the prayers. Father, thank you for another beautiful day I am privileged to see. To you alone be all praises and adorations in Jesus' name. Isaiah chapter 50 verse 4, Psalms 5 to 3. One. Father, thank you for another beautiful day I am privileged to see. To you alone be all praises and adorations in Jesus' name. Isaiah chapter 50 verse 4, Psalms 5 to 3. 1. Father, thank you for another beautiful day I am privileged to see. To you alone be all praises and adorations in Jesus' name. Isaiah chapter 50 verse 4, Psalms 5 to 3. 1. Father, thank you for another beautiful day I am privileged to see. To you alone be all praises and adorations in Jesus' name. Isaiah chapter 50 verse 4, Psalms 5 to 3. 2. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, never allow any mortal man to tamper with my glory as you disappoint all manipulations of the wicked over my life in Jesus' name. Job.5. 12. Joel chapter 2 verses 26 to 27. 2. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, Never allow any mortal man to tamper with my glory as you disappoint all manipulations of the wicked over my life in Jesus' name. Job.5. 12. Joel chapter 2 verses 26 to 27. 2. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, Never allow any mortal man to tamper with my glory as you disappoint all manipulations of the wicked over my life in Jesus' name. Job.5. 12. Joel chapter 2 verses 26 to 27. 2. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, never allow any mortal man to tamper with my glory as you disappoint all manipulations of the wicked over my life in Jesus' name. Job.5. 12. Joel chapter 2 verses 26 to 27. 3. Father, through the greatness of your power, destroy every attempt of the enemy to cause unrest and misunderstanding in my family as you establish unending peace in my home in Jesus' name. 
Philip 4 to 7, Ezekiel chapter 34 verse 25. Father, through the greatness of your power, destroy every attempt of the enemy to cause unrest and misunderstanding in my family as you establish unending peace in my home in Jesus' name. Philip 4-7, Ezekiel chapter 34 verse 25. Through the greatness of your power, destroy every attempt of the enemy to cause unrest and misunderstanding in my family as you establish unending peace in my home in Jesus' name. Philip 4-7, Ezekiel chapter 34 verse 25. 3. Father, through the greatness of your power, destroy every attempt of the enemy to cause unrest and misunderstanding in my family as you establish unending peace in my home in Jesus' name. Philip 4-7, Ezekiel chapter 34 verse 25. 4. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, let the remaining days of this month be unto me days of unusual visitations that will cause me to scream, shout, and leap for joy of celebrations in Jesus' name. Genesis chapter 21 verses 1 to 2 and 6. 4. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, let the remaining days of this month be unto me days of unusual visitations that will cause me to scream, shout, and leap for joy of celebrations in Jesus' name. Genesis chapter 21 verses 1 to 2 and 6. 4. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, let the remaining days of this month be unto me days of unusual visitations that will cause me to scream, shout, and leap for joy of celebrations in Jesus' name. Genesis chapter 21 verses 1 to 2 and 6. 4. Father, by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, let the remaining days of this month be unto me days of unusual visitations that will cause me to scream, shout, and leap for joy of celebrations in Jesus' name. Genesis chapter 21 verses 1 to 2 and 6. 5. Father, by the blood of everlasting covenant, preserve, protect, and defend me and my entire family as you make evil far away from my domain in the remaining days of this year. There shall be no occasion for weeping or gnashing of teeth in Jesus' name. Psalms 91, 1-4, Psalms 59, 1-2, Revelation chapter 21 verse 4. 5. Father, by the blood of everlasting covenant, preserve, protect, and defend me and my entire family as you make evil far away from my domain in the remaining days of this year. There shall be no occasion for weeping or gnashing of teeth in Jesus' name. Psalms 91, 1-4, Psalms 59, 1-2, Revelation chapter 21 verse 4. 5. Father, by the blood of everlasting covenant, 
Preserve, protect, and defend me and my entire family as you make evil far away from my domain in the remaining days of this year. There shall be no occasion for weeping or gnashing of teeth in Jesus' name. Psalms 91, 1-4, Psalms 59, 1-2, Revelation chapter 21 verse 4. Five. Father, by the blood of everlasting covenant, preserve, protect, and defend me and my entire family as you make evil far away from my domain in the remaining days of this year. There shall be no occasion for weeping or gnashing of teeth in Jesus' name. Psalms 91, 1-4, Psalms 59, 1-2, Revelation chapter 21 verse 4. Pray these prayers and shout a believing, Amen. Dot. May God Almighty answer our prayers in Jesus' name. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel for more videos.